All right, aerial photogrammetry. Um, so aerial photogrammetry uh, is supported in Trimble Business Center in kind of a, a two-faceted way. Um, so uh, if you're using a UAV with uh, support on the, the provider side, um, you know, oftentimes the finishing software or the completion software uh, to finish the mission um, that will allow you to export a Trimble JXL format, such as uh, some of the SenseFly drones, um, the EB drones. Um, we've uh, got interoperability with Dallaire's UX11 um, fixed wing, uh, as well as uh, recent support for uh, Wingtra uh, drones as well in the Wingtra 1 system. Um, there's some others in, in active development as well, so stay tuned there. Um, that's all supported directly in TVC. So it's simple drag and drop operation. Do your processing, create your uh, ortho mosaic image, create your point cloud, create a raster DSM, register to it to to uh, ground control points, GCPs, uh, or not. Um, of course, as surveyors, we want you to be as uh, you know, we want you to get it as tight as possible. So GCP is strongly recommended. Won't go off on too much of a tangent there. Um, but the, another unique thing about Trimble Business Center and support for aerial photogrammetry workflows is the included UAS Master package. So UAS Master will support all third-party non-JXL uh, based uh, UAV data, and that is included in your aerial photogrammetry license and ships with TBC. So it's already something you've got if you've installed TBC. Um, and then you can send data back and forth. So, you know, you can import your, your ground control points, set your coordinate system in TVC, send that off to serve as the basis for your UAS master project, do your adjustments, and there's some really powerful and customized uh, tools in UAS master for advanced aerial photogrammetry processing. Create your deliverables and then kick them back into TVC, and then we play that integration game again. You know, with with your survey data uh, all in one platform in TVC. Um, Ray, anything to add there? Uh, I think you summarized that the. Uh capability of TBC very well here. Uh, maybe just the one thing to clarify, just in case some of the attendees um, are not very familiar with the uh, aerial photogrammetry module of TBC today. Um, to me, the major difference here is uh, when you import UAV data into TBC environment, they are pictures. So TBC will be able to generate auto images as well as point clouds on top of those uh, aerial images for you. Um, once you get the point cloud generated, then um, the point cloud is a point cloud. You can uh, choose to continue the processing in TBC, or in this stage, you are able to export it into Triple RealWorks or any other third party uh, point cloud processing software as well. But the, the, the beauty is TBC will prepare your data set for you. And that's a, yeah. a good point. So uh, really, a point cloud is a point cloud. So uh, no matter where you're getting it, you can bring it into RealWorks or TBC to enjoy uh, the benefits of the, you know, the the CAD lines or the inspection tools um, in either of them. So uh, it's it's um, really surprising how many people are using the getting point clouds from UAVs today uh, for inspecting or doing their land surveying. Great. Thank you, experts. Here is the resources available to you for TBC Aerial Photogrammetry.